Hello, this is Char from The Real Kitchen for Real People. And today we are going to have Mexican cheeseburger egg rolls. So I want you to come along and cook with me. I've already in this skillet have browned uh, a half a pound of ground beef. Now I use 93% so I don't have all that oil in there. But if you don't use 93%, you might want to drain that off before you start adding your spices and stuff. So in here I have a half a pound of 93 uh, ground beef. I have about a fourth of uh, chopped onions. And then I added black pepper. And I added salt and these are all to your taste and I added onion powder and garlic powder and a little paprika for coloring and just a little cumin to that kind of give it that spice and uh, I always use oregano when I'm using cumin. I always use the oregano. I'm about out of it. Okay. So, and then also in here, you want to add about a teaspoon of Worcestershire sauce. And that just kind of pops the flavors in there. Okay. And then you just mix those all up. Cook those all together and it'll come out like this so you don't see all no oil and greasy this in there and then I use these uh, egg roll wraps I get these from Walmart but I guess you can get them at your uh, grocery store whatever kind but these are the vegan egg roll wraps that I'm gonna use okay and while you're doing all of this, you want to heat up your oil. It's about three cups of veggie oil. So you just have that be uh, heating up while you fixing your filling for your egg rolls. Okay. Okay, now that your uh, ground beef is ready, your filling is ready, you want to take, I'm going to take it over here to the counter and show you the cheeses I'm using. I'm using the Mexican style blend cheese and sharp cheddar cheese. These are the two I'm going to use. You can also use pepper jack and they have all kind of jalapeno cheeses that you might want to use in yours. And now I also have, besides my cheeses, I have the, my pickles. I diced up some dill pickles and I also added some dill radish and I just mixed this all up in a different little plate. So I'm going to add that to my filling. And then I also have my wraps ready. These are how your wraps will be and you will start from this angle forward when you're filling your uh, egg roll. And then you'll also I'll show you uh, how you're going to seal it at the end. Okay, you grab your egg roll wrapper and you want flour side down. I see that little flour on there? You want that down and you want it at an angle where this is pointing towards you. Okay, then you take about a tablespoon of your filling. About a tablespoon of it. And then you want to put your pickles on because this is important. You don't want your pickles on top because they'll slide. So you're putting your pickles on there. And then you put your cheeses on there, whatever cheese you want in there. So I, like I said, I have sharp cheddar and Mexican style blend since this is a Mexican cheeseburger. Egg roll. Then you kind of push it back like that to kind of push it in here then you fold this pointed end over and push at the same time like pushing it back okay then you want to 
tuck those sides in like that and like that kind of like an envelope and then you take a little water and you brush to seal it and brush that on there like that and then continue to roll your egg roll and there you go there's your egg roll so you just continue to do that till you finish with your filling and then I'll be back to show you okay now that you have your egg rolls all rolled then your and your oil is heated you want to take a, a spoon that has holes in it and just drop it into the hot oil. And what I'm going to do to get that real crispy look is to drop them twice. So I want to get them brown, a little brown first and turn them so you have to watch them pretty close. Because you're not trying to get them all the way brown at this point because you want that cr you know that crunchy now if you don't want crunchy that's fine you can just take them out uh, the first time but we like ours crispy so see like that you take that out and it's ready okay I'll do another one We're going to drop another one in and I always drop it with the seal part down because you want that to seal first. You can drop more than one. And just kind of turn them as they brown. And these are so fun to make. And you can be so creative with them. You can make a Philly cheese egg rolls. You can make breakfast egg rolls. You can make a uh, baked potato egg roll. All kinds. So you can really have fun with them. And it's a very inexpensive snack. In between meal snacks. Okay. Now I'm going to drop them again, and mind you, this is on medium heat after your oil has gotten hot. So I'm going to drop this in there again and brown it a little bit longer. And that just makes them extra crispy. And that's what we like, extra crispy. And that's all it is to it. And then you have it with your different sauces if you want to make a sauce to go with it. Uh, you can have ketchup and mayonnaise or whatever you want. Hot sauce, salsa. But we're going to have salsa with ours since it's a Mexican cheeseburger egg roll. So if you like this video, be sure to give me thumbs up. And comment and let me know what type of egg roll you make. And if you haven't subscribed, you need to do that. So you can get all of the new recipes automatically sent to you. So as you know, I'm going to get ready to eat. So until next time, uh, love, love.